afternoon all. I couldn't resist to come back to the weary traveller. I've got Fred again with me. I've come with my feeder rod again. I've got some maggots I need to use up. I've gone for a size 16 hook this time, so I'm only going to use two maggots. I had plenty of bites last time, so and I missed quite a lot. I think it was all because of a big hook and whatnot. So I'm here now. I'm only, only going to be here for probably an hour or so just to use up these maggots. Should be home sorting my trip out for tomorrow, but plenty of time left in the day. So I'm going to give it another go here. I'm going to be fishing that far bank. I was having the roach over by that snag, so I'm going to have another go at that and see if we can get some more roach in. So I just got myself a lovely little roach. Bite straight away on a single maggot on a size 16 hook. Instant. So the next cast is a lovely little perch. Absolute pristine condition. Nice, single maggot again. Right, let's see how quick this is, Fred. Lovely little dates off that cast. That was a caster and a maggot. Nice size dates. So this is the rig that I'm using. It's just a swim feeder. Mainline six pound line with a swivel that stops it. Got a four pound hook link with a size 16 hook. And I'm just casting to the far bank. Fred gets excited on every cast. Put the rod down. Getting little nibbles straight away. So just have yourself a nice, another perch. Slightly bigger than the last one. Just get him out of the show yet. Lovely little perch, that one. So they're getting bigger, it's nice. So I've got myself another little perch, this one is smaller. I think I've found a shoal of them, which is nice. Another little pristine perch. Beautiful fish. Finally got myself a little chublet. Look at the fins on that, they are absolutely stunning. That is a lovely conditioned chublet. It's not the massive, but it's beautiful. Pop this one back. next time I might make, make a visit here at the Weary Traveller I think I'm going to bring my trotting rod and probably walk along the river or walk across the stretch here and get onto the, the rapids right underneath the bridge go to the far end and then just trot down there I think it'll be uh, quite rewarding probably won't bring Fred if I do that because 
he might be a bit of a pain in the ass over there he'll be in the deep part of the water swimming around and then that kill it at least when he's in the water near me here he's he's nowhere near the fish certainly doesn't bother anything which is all good so i've had a couple of little little days as well about the size of my finger that i haven't shown you but it's definitely worked with downsizing the hook and only using two maggots so i'm probably going to give it another half an hour i've got to take my mum shopping get a few more bits for my trip out with nathan tomorrow really looking forward to that hopefully the fish will be a little bit bigger than what i'm catching here today we're going to the specimen lake so hopefully we'll have some nice sized carp, fingers crossed. We're there for 48 hours. So between us I'm sure we'll be able to catch something. Right, time for one more cast and then we're gonna go home, Fred. Right, so that's me done. It's time to go home, do my chores, get ready for my big trip tomorrow with Nathan. Take my other shopping. Fred's had a little bit of a time out with me again. So, all packed up. Just got to get in the car now and go all. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you all again soon. Very soon, actually. So take care everyone and bye for now.